the farmer and his donkey. Farmer Walid's favorite donkey slips and falls into a deep hole. Try as he might, but he can't pull it out. No matter how hard he tries, it is of no use. The nearest town is hundreds of kilometers away. There are no vehicles passing by either. The sun is starting to get harsh. Oh Allah, I need your help. I don't know what to do. Please show me the way. Please help me. I am in so much trouble. Farmer Walid starts to make lots of dua. Whenever it is time to pray Salah, he makes wudu, at the river, which is a few kilometers away. Prays and makes long duas. After every few hours, he comes to the hole to feed his donkey by throwing some grass into the hole. After a couple of days and many hours of making dua, sad farmer Walid decides to bury his donkey alive. Soil is poured onto the donkey from above. The donkey feels the load, shakes it off, and steps on it. More soil is poured onto the donkey again. The donkey shakes it off and steps up. The more the load was poured, the higher it rose. By noon, the donkey is on level ground. He steps out of the area where the hole used to be. And within minutes, he is once again, grazing in green pastures. Alhamdulillah. Farmer Walid has never been so happy. He does sujood ash shukr immediately to thank his lord. Alhamdulillahi rabbil, alameen. Moral of the story after much shaking off of problems and stepping up, learning from him, and making plenty of effort and doer, and then leaving the matter to God. One will graze in green pastures, inshar Allah. Please note that not all problems will get solved by just making dua. Sometimes, Allah will not allow one's problems to be solved, despite one making plenty of dua. However, when one makes more and more dua, Allah loves him even more. Therefore, even if one's problem remains unsolved, one will definitely feel much calmer, more patient, more tranquil and happier, inshallah. Let's remember that Allah